Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Minecraft and today I'm back on the Days Grow the Border series. I haven't done anything off camera, it's, this is literally where I left it off at the end of the last video. So I do still need to go down and clear the caves out. But today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be building a little mini house because I feel like that's a good start to the series and then I'll do a lot of the cave clearing off camera because I feel like that would be a lot better. And yeah, let's just go up that absolutely scared the crap out of me then when that bat just dropped. I was not expecting that whatsoever. But yeah, let's just keep going up. I'm hoping I keep getting stuck. I need to find a better way to go down here. That lag was horrible then. Okay, is it? God damn it, I don't want to get stuck there because that's where mobs keep spawning. I really didn't like that sound either. It sounded like something had spawned up here. Okay, but as you can see, the border has expanded a fair bit. So I'm probably going to be building my house or sort of like somewhere around here, maybe, is what I'm thinking. So obviously, I'm going to need to clear that. But yeah, let's just clear a couple blocks here. And then probably just build it right here. This seems like a decent spot. So, gonna do the good old usual design. Hasn't failed me yet. There we go. Just gonna do this just because it's easier when quickly doing it. And just connect it up. Okay, so it's actually going to night time which is not good because I don't have anything like a bed which means I am going to have to go down and hide in the cave for a little bit so yeah I'll be back with you guys when it's the morning okay guys so I've just seen the border has expanded which means it should be theoretically a new day so I'm hoping if I go up the it should be completely fine, shouldn't run into any issues whatsoever. Obviously all of these have expanded a fair bit so i got to be careful when uh, going up just in case something spawns. It's a bit of an issue that I might have to deal with, hopefully not. But yeah, we'll have to just wait and see. So this is another one I'm going to have to break. And the good thing is I have got partial... oh god. Come on, that should have hit him. Honestly, after playing Bedrock earlier the, earlier today, this feels so much easier. Like, Bedrock was honestly being a pain for that. Like, I physically could not do anything. Okay, so... I've decided to use jungle planks because I feel like they will work a whole lot better. So, let's just fill all this in. Obviously that's where the door is going to be, did not need to place that. Now I am going to have to find some food real fast because I do not have anything. And yeah, I'm running fairly low on health. I could do with some, like even if I could get some rotten flesh, that'd be good. So I will leave that for now. Just place that there, just above the door. I'm probably just gonna, I actually need to break this quickly. Do that just in case there is stuff outside so I can just hide. 
And then, yeah, let's just clear the floor, completely fill all of this in. And then we just have to bring the stuff inside. So, there we go. Just need to grab the crafting table. Oh, God. That's not good. Honestly, I'll just make another crafting table. It's fine. Then... Furnace. Probably grab a chest as well. What I could do with... What I'll probably do is... I haven't got any sticks at the moment. Grab some sticks and then I will make a so I can place these seeds down. Hopefully they're not right there. Luckily not. There we go. And that should grow into wheat and then once that does I will then be alright to um, Okay, nice. He didn't give me any rotten flesh though which is what I wanted. Honestly, try and draw him out into the open, hopefully, and he can start burning. Nice, like that. No, don't come this way. Okay, hopefully nothing else spawned. And obviously, as the border expands, it's going to become a bit more difficult if I don't start to clear this area. So I'm probably going to have to do that off camera. I might just quickly clear some of it now. Like this one here. But yeah, I think obviously I'm going to have to start clearing the area a tiny bit. And then the caves are going to become a massive, massive issue if I can't sort them out. So let's just grab that. I don't really need these now. But I wonder if there's any other sort of food stuff. So obviously you've got these cocoa things, but I don't think... You can craft anything like super decent with them. I have to have a look. I think all the other stuff you would need to craft something decent I don't have. So, I mean, I can collect them for now, but I'll have to have a look. Oh, a um. Is it an ocelot? I think that's what they're called, ocelots. So, what can I... I can mean brown dye, but I don't really want dye, I want food. So, yeah, I need wheat for that. So potentially that could be a good source for the wheat, rather than creating bread, maybe? Yeah, that's it. Obviously you've got cakes, I think, as well, but... That ain't going to be any good, so I'm basically just waiting on these to grow. Actually, that's a thought. I've got bone mill. Oh, I can make bone mill. Let's just do that. And then, oh nice, got plenty more seeds from that. So... I should then, hopefully, where was that noise? I'm really hoping that's underground. Okay, so I've now got plenty of wheat growing, which is quite nice. I might have some more bones down, but I'm going to have to try and grab them later. So, I wonder what, I might just quickly search up on my phone what, what replenishes more health. Uh, more hunger. Then she's more hunger. Is it cookies? Yeah, cookies or bread in my pot. Okay, so. The um, the cookies will actually restore more, apparently. Because I think the bread is said restored, I think, like, three hunger points. 
the cookies in total restore about 16 so yeah that's fairly good just need to use this to try and get my health up a bit and even better than that I've still got a wheat left so I haven't had to uh, use any of that up use as much so yeah I should be able to get my health back to pretty much full I reckon like or at least close to it so let's just quickly try and clear this I reckon I'm gonna say I really hope I don't get attacked right now good thing is I'm now high enough I shouldn't be attacked okay nice but yeah, I definitely think the cookies was the better choice because, you know, I've replenished a lot of my health. And the other thing is, it means I only need to get one more wheat and then, boom, I can have some more cookies. Whereas, obviously, if it was bread, I'd have to get three more. So, I'm fairly happy with that for now. Let's just eat this last cookie. Not going to be enough to my health up but the health is a lot further than it would have been had I used bread instead so let's just quickly clear this bit behind my base or well, behind my little house just to sort of make it a bit better and nice that is an apple I will take that you know at this point food is food like I'll just take anything oh this is a big tree I hate these trees so much. I think I'll just quickly clear this and then that'll probably be the end of the video. So. Let's just check is there any more wood anywhere? Doesn't look like it, which is surprising because normally trees like this have a lot more wood in them. Oh yeah, that feels... Oh, that's another tree, so that kind of makes sense. But, thanks to the cookies and the apple, my health is now back to full, which is very nice. I feel like I don't need to worry as much now. You know, I'm not going to turn around and suddenly be one-shot by something, which is good. I do need to try and, if I can, get some sheep so I can... Oh, is that another apple? That is another apple. Try and get some sheep so I can sleep. Because, yeah, at the moment I am going to have to go back down because I can't hide up here. Because if I try and uh, hide up there, then uh, I'm pretty sure, I can't remember, is it banshees might end up spawning? And I really don't want to be dealing with banshees. Especially when I don't have a good source of food, so I'll just put that there for now. And yeah, I saw I got another apple. So I am back to full health and full hunger, which is really nice. I've got a nice little house built. And yeah, cleared a little bit of the area, so I'm fairly happy with how this video went. Like I said, I've got some more bones there, so I can create some more cookies when I go back up. And yeah, I'll probably end up doing that off camera. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do for the next video yet. So it'll probably be quite a while before you see this series again. I have to try and work out what exactly it is that I want to do for the next episode of this series. I've got a couple ideas for obviously the other series I haven't done in a while. I've done quite a few of these ones recently. So yeah, it'll probably be a while before you see this series again. But yeah, let me know what you'd like to see me do on this series. Maybe the next thing you'd like to see me do or any other series you'd like to see me continue. Or maybe even ones you'd like to see me start. And yeah, any other games that I see on this channel. And I'll see you guys all in the next one.